Hey guys, it's Kevin back with another video. We got my granddaughter. We're gonna do a little bit of mushroom hunting. She wants mushrooms and ketchup. So we're gonna look around and see if we can find some morels today. Uh, they should be out, or at least we should be starting to come up. But we go find them. We'll let you guys in on them. Okay, everybody, look what me and Livy found. We found mushrooms. We found some. These are called morels, or we can call them haystack mushrooms. We don't want to eat nothing unless we know for sure what it is, huh? I don't know. So let's get our bag out, Livy. Woohoo! Pappy got a bag in his pocket, okay? No, this is in my bag. Hey, wait. It's in my bag. It's in your bag. Here, yeah. look. Yeah, Pappy got this kind of bag. No, dude, it's in my bag that I put my bag. Watch, don't break them. We're going to eat these with some ketchup, right? Yep. All right. And I'm on my way here. Here, you hold Pappy bag. You hold my bag. You can put them in there. Oh, I, will, I got. I, I got my like you. Well, here. You want. I, I just got that already. Look. Oh, my goodness. Well, here. Let's use Pappy's bag. No, no. I use my bag. Oh, okay. Well, use your bag. But you're going to break the mushrooms. I will. Yep, I will. All right. Okay, let's let me Pappy get them, put them in your bag. Okay. Let's put them in your bag. One. How many is this? Two. Mm -hmm. And then three. Okay. And then up here's another one. Look. Here's one here. Uh, right there. That's a nice mother. Okay, get it. You get it, Livy. Alright, put it in your bag. Okay. Now, and zip it up. Yeah, okay. You zip it up, okay? All right. Is Daddy finding any back air? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. They found one. Did you? Yeah. yeah. Four okay. of them. You can't beat getting the grandkids out, getting in the woods, and hunting for mushrooms. Now, ain't that the cutest thing you ever seen? Well, she had her own bag, and she was insisting on putting them in it, too. So we're going to keep looking and see what all we can find. Yeah, honey. I found some more. You I found, found You found more? Yeah. All right. Be careful now you don't trip over them sticks. Now, yesterday, I took the granddaughter, and my son and my granddaughter went out looking for some mushrooms. Now, anytime you get the chance to take your grandkids out, son or daughter, um... You need to take them out because this is something that helps them, you know, when they get older. They'll say, oh, I remember going mushroom hunting. But not only that, they'll know that they can, there is food out there on your land and you, you don't even know it. And a lot of people don't know it because nobody's ever taught them. But my granddaughter, when we said we want to go mushroom hunting, she said, oh, it's just, I, I need ketchup. Well, you know she's going to eat them, so yesterday we took her out and we found a few little mushrooms and I don't think they're up real big right now but in the area that I'm in right now they don't grow very big and I have a lot of um, turkeys and I'm not sure whether these turkeys are eating these mushrooms or breaking them apart and trying to um, there, there's always bugs inside the morel mushroom so I cut them in half leave them soak in salt water maybe even overnight um, <clears throat> But anyhow, we're back out in the woods. I'm by myself now, and uh, I'm sure everybody's asleep right now. So I'm going to pick a mess of mushrooms and see if I can get them cooked up. So I'm going to show you a few of them here I just found. And like I said, they're not real big right now, but you can see them right there. Nice little mushrooms. So that's the uh, morel mushroom. Some people call them haystacks. Um, they're a very good little mushroom. You just, uh, you know, you can't eat these raw. You don't want to eat these raw. These have to be cooked. So we're going to go ahead and get some picked. As, as I'm looking, I could see one right over there. There's one right there. And then I see another one right there. But that's the haystack or the morel mushroom. 
while we're out here in the woods uh, looking for mushrooms, we're finding bloodroot just everywhere. See bloodroot everywhere through here. Little pieces coming up. So, you know spring's here. If you guys didn't see the video on the bloodroot, I do also have a video on the bloodroot you can watch. Check out my channel. Look who else is out moving around today. Maybe he's eating some mushrooms. Never know. He's awake. Looks awful muddy. Must have just crawled out of his hole. But he is moving around. Pretty little box turtle. Man, it's great to be out in the woods. Gotta love it. Well, look what else we come across. A nice little patch of ramps. I might take a few of these just to have them with my uh, mushrooms. Sounds like a good idea. We'll get a couple of these out of the ground. Okay, we got our ramps back here and our mushrooms. We're going to go ahead and just cut these up. We're going to dice them up. I didn't take up all the ramps and I didn't give up all the mushrooms. But the mushrooms are just starting to come up now. So, But I'm going to go ahead and fry up these ramps and the mushrooms. And I stopped by the barn and got some fresh eggs. So we're going to have some eggs, ramps, and mushrooms this morning. Um, I didn't want to take a lot of them ramps over there because there wasn't a real big patch of them. And I just took the tops of them. So we'll let that patch grow big. I got a big patch back over the hill that does really good. I can get them from there anytime I want. So... So we got our ramps there, and we got our mushrooms soaking in some salt water right now. Uh, like I said, I didn't get very many mushrooms, but you can notice, I don't know if you could see, but on the top of your mushrooms there, you can see little bugs. Now, them little bugs are probably what the turkeys may be tearing their mushrooms up. So... I don't know if they're eating the bugs or they're eating the mushroom or what they're doing, but I do know that almost everywhere I go, the turkeys have tore the ground up pretty good. So we're going to let them soak just a little bit in some salt water, and then we'll rinse them off real good and get them cooked up. Okay, we got our mushrooms. They soak for a while in the salt water. It's pretty, you probably should let them soak overnight in there, but I'm going to try to get this video done. So I got some eggs here. I'm going to do a few eggs. Like I said, we just got these since they're out of the barn. And uh, it's going to be some good fresh eggs with mushrooms, green pepper, or some mushrooms, ramps, and eggs. I'm going to scramble these guys up. Okay, for a little added flavor, I put some butter in there and I sprayed the skillet with some non-stick spray. And we're going to go ahead and let that heat up a little bit. Alright, we got our skillet pretty good and hot there. We'll go ahead and pour our eggs in. Now we're going to cook these low and slow, so... We'll do our ramps in there and our mushrooms. Mix them around a little bit. Like I said, we're going to cook these low and slow. I'll cook them as slow as I can. I'm going to take a little bit of sea salt. Get a little sea salt on them. A little bit of cracked pepper. I'll let them cook okay got them flipped over we're gonna let them cook really really slow like I got the heat on as low as I could put it you can't go any lower so I got the skillet hot when I first put it in and then I turned the, sto the, the stove down almost to almost to off as high as low as I can get it and I'm gonna let them cook on this side and then we'll have some good eggs well, I got me some breakfast. I got some onion, or I got my ramps in there. I got my mushrooms in there. Made me a couple pieces of toast and some eggs out of the barn. 
Don't forget, if you ever get the chance, take your kids out there and show them what these mushrooms are and the grandkids. Take them out there and show them because they're not going to know unless somebody shows them. And do it while they're young. I mean, that's the best time. They get used to it and they know it and they grow up doing it. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Don't forget to subscribe, leave me thumbs up, thumbs down, or comment if you'd like. Till next time. Good.